cool. Actually, it should be even finals, I think. I'm, I, well, I kind no, of don't I, hope because that's not I would give him give the, the finals to Randy. 3-1. Maybe Drone can pick a game, but ah, it's best of five, so they... 3-1. Can cheese. I'm calling it now. Anyway, we are on to the bronze match, however. Oh, sorry. Welcome back, ZeroK fans. This is Shadow Fury 3 along with Floris on the bronze match of the March 2014 1v1 tournament. And it is Lowry and Google Frog. Google Frog put up a good fight against Drone, but really did not know how to handle the late game quite as well as Drone did. But now we're at Lowry versus Google Frog on Archer's Valley, and we saw before that Lowry is... He's... I don't know how he is against Google Frog. Oh, Interesting. Air Arrogate. start. Okay, Google Frog's going for a comp snipe. And tanks I'm, for I'm, Lowry. I'm fist pumping. I'm going... Yeah, air start. Air start. You like your air starts? I like silly stuff. Yeah, that's it's a it's a thing. Air starts. Just go in. You get four shadows. You snipe their. Con I said you get four shadows, Google Frog. Ah, he knows what he's doing, but <laughs> he cannot avoid it. It's tanks for Lori. That's what he does. That is this. Yep. That's really funny. He started playing only tanks at the time. Um, Panthers were overpowered like hell. Mm -hmm. um, and now he's stuck with him, and he's kind of good with it. Yeah, I remember when I... Well, actually, it was kind of funny, because I first found out that Panthers are overpowered when I used them against Sakdoth, and actually held off for quite some time. Like, he threw in Kodachis at me, and I built Panthers. I thought, I've got to build something! And... <laughs> he was just... I, I ended up it. actually lasting for quite some time. It was on, I think, Into Battle. But Oh, yeah, yeah. That's a weird map, but anyway. I haven't seen that map this tournament yet. No, I don't think a lot of people want to play on it. Honestly, I'm not surprised. It's a really wonky map with the way the ramps are set up. Like, it's kind of yeah, a vehicle that's... map, but the ramps really slow it down. And what about uh, Onyx Cauldron? I don't know why we haven't seen Onyx Cauldron. That's an awesome map. Love that map. Exactly. I think it might be in the finals, though. I think it might be actually the... No, Wanderlust is the start map of the finals. I'm not sure what the start map of... or Onyx is not reused. Iced Coffee what? was used in, this, in the round of 16, which I'm kind of happy about. But... <laughs> yeah, indeed. I, I think I've seen so much cool games on that map. It's so different from everything else we have. Yeah, I... StarCraft background. <laughs> That's all Probably. I'm going to say. My maps, my Akron maps reflect that too, which is most of the Akron maps. And... Okay, but... Um, Lori wants to have a uh, flag truck. Wow, yeah, I'm not surprised either. A ghoul frog is... Bombing mechs. Nice snipe. He's sniping all the mechs. Making the right choice oh there. Wow, keeping Lowry down in economy. I mean, Lowry's going to get that copperhead in a minute. He, he missed this opportunity. If uh, Lowry, I mean, uh, if Google Frog drops two bombs on those two missile turrets now, he doesn't have anything. Yeah. No, three missile. There's three missile turrets. He cannot even uh, afford that flag truck. Well, there's. Wait, what do you mean? He doesn't have mechs. Uh, well, he has one. three mechs. Or two. He can't two afford mexes. it, but it's just that he has to split econ between his commander and his factory. It's taken two or three minutes to build that flak truck. I think I think Google Frog's taking game one here. Yeah, he if he up. takes the, the hits with the fighters and drop the bumps. Yeah, I'm surprised. Oh, flak trucks. No, welder's out. But yeah, the flak... See, that's the thing. Tank has a hard time against bombers, because anyone else, if you see air start, you just switch over to AA and usually good. Hover's at the best time, I think. But tanks, not yeah. so much. Two shadows should be able to kill a flak. Um, yeah. But once it out, it's out, uh, the air will stop. Sure, but it's not out yet. That's for sure. Oh, it's and it looks like Google Frog is switching. He's going to be building a factory somewhere. Yep, Cloaky bought yeah. factory built in the center of the map. Mm, Claves, I assume. Probably. That should do the trick, though. And that flak tank is out. Just got out. And it is... A threat, but really, at this point, Lowry actually doing a great job keeping his economy going. You notice Lowry's actually ahead in economy despite Google Frog knocking him down so much. Yeah. The Google Frog didn't... I mean, he kept even with the rating. Okay, now getting another one more max, but even then, no, not easily. He gets the bomber? Nope, bomber lives. No, Avengers but he died. didn't? No, the bomber just barely uh... lived. Bomber lives with, like, 86 HP. And glaives are incoming. Yeah, that should take care of the flak tank, no problem. However... Oh, look at all the missile turrets. 
Yeah, but what about the Oh, the main base is completely undefended. That flag tank's the only thing going for him. And it's in the wrong spot now. It's in the center of the map. The glaives are probably gonna flank it too. Google Frog, he's going up at the right time. If he attacks with those glaives, he's got he it. Stopped, yeah, he stopped bomber production. He only wants to make a couple of construction planes and go from there. Mm hmm And the glaives are not attacking. Why, I don't know. Too um, many missile turrets? An Avenger? No, I mean attacking the flag tank that was out in the open. Although I don't think Google Frog knew about that. Ah. You can just retreat it. That's true, but it probably would have taken... No, it wouldn't have died. 1200 HP, it would have lived. It's pretty fast. Although, Those at this point, if are... Google Frog keeps tabs on where... Like, throws in a glaive or two here and there to keep tabs on the flag tank. He can keep bombing out everything. He's actually going to bomb right into the flag tank. He's moving his glaive sort of in a position, but the bomber is in a bad spot. Going to attack that flag tank. He wants to do a, an attack over the no. hill? Well, not... Ah, that flag tank's going to kill it. That shadow might get... It's going to get the radar, and it's going to die. No that's chance all. of getting out of there. It is down. Ouch. Because that Brrr. sucks. Because that's... Like, defenders aren't really going to do too much here, but... That flag tank... Uh, I think he'll, he can lose his factory now. Yeah, I think you're right. Lowry's factory has no defenses around it whatsoever. He, he If he not, has noticed it, he either start, tries to stop it, or he starts a new factory now. Where his commander is. Yeah, I see that happening. But... It, does, he knows now. He's definitely sure of this now. He doesn't have... He has Kodachis, but they aren't up. They're not going to build in time. The factory is dead. At the same time, Kodachi is coming in to try to deal with Clickbot Factory. Ah, Tank Factory the is well going there will kill him. down. <laughs> oh, but uh, nano turrets explode. Be careful. Oh, yeah. That's a good thing to point out. Everything explodes in this game. No, but welders... I mean, uh, nano turrets explode. Nano turrets are, one of them, are a thing in this game. Therefore, they explode. No, but they really do damage. They explode harder than... Oh, okay. Yeah, thinking, the everything has TNT in its frames. Like, that's yeah. common knowledge. Like, if it dies, it blows up and takes everything else around it. Especially factories. Oh, yeah. And a shadow dropping down, getting rid of a Kodachi, no problem. Although <laughs> in the oh, the Kodachi's actually on fire slightly. Sorry, the shadow went through the napalm field on its way down. Oops. But still, those glaives coming in, getting rid of the welders. The right, the dead right side is getting claimed by uh, oh. complaints. Clokeybot coming in as well. Yeah, you're right. The right side is taken in. Google Frog getting advantage on that. Clokeybot factory was being built by the welders, but it's not going to last too long. Lowry's commander not building a factory of its own. Is other constructor not building a factory either? Going for more metal extractors. I don't see what Lowry has planned. Oh, he Clokeybot. Clokeybot. Uh, he's dead. He is dead, but he's going to try for it. So he's going to build a caretaker to a Clokeybot factory and then see if that'll save him. Maybe with warriors? I don't know. No. 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 That's... Google Frog can just spam glaives. Actually, if it, warriors start being spammed, he can spam rockers. Like... Yeah, he, basically he, can, he could even spam snipers or whatever. He will then... Yeah. Actually, sniper spam would be really interesting to see. I've never seen, seen like two snipers ever. Oh, wow. Yeah. Like I said, the one game. There was one game where people built snipers. And built two. To fight a felon ball. No one ever uses them. I think but they're good. Oh. If you can snipe from behind your own defensive turrets. Yeah, they're good. They're just underused. They're undervalued. Like, Cloak about Factory has a lot of units. Most of which yeah. are not used. Snipers are basically never used. Hammers are never used. Ticks are used from time to time. Jet throws are situational. Erasers are never used, much to my surprise. I think eraser tick would be broken, but no one ever uses that. Or even just eraser to move your army around with your opponent noticing under radar. Uh, I think I, I use all of the units except... Uh, erasers? No, Mortys. Or hammers. Ah. An eraser. Hammer and eraser. Yeah, like I said, I use hammer from time to time if my opponent's very heavily defended. And that's game! Google Frog throws... Well, Google GG. Frog acknowledges the GG. Lori throws in the towel. Yep. That is game Their one. Chance. But yeah, as what, I was what? saying, it, hammer I use for defended positions. Eraser, I've just never seen used. I never think to use it myself because it's 600. It's like... Uh -huh. I don't understand if I should use it or not because it's so... It's expensive, but yet... Cloak. Yeah, you can... Cloaked uh, moving bombs. You can get close to shield blobs. Mm -hmm. So he has a uh, felon, and then you make an eraser, and you run into ticks. 
Yeah, exactly. And they and don't see you until they explode. But you don't see people building erasers. Anyway, game two is going to be starting. Yep. And I'll be on the Red back, Comet. Uh, Lowry learned the lesson. Or at least Lowry knows what Google Frog doesn't like or work with well. Mm -hmm. So we should see this working out fairly effectively. Yep. I'll be uh, right back. Two minutes, okay? Okay. Anyway, yeah, we are in game two of Google Frog versus Lowry. Game one was Google Frogs. Let's see what Lowry has. This is the bronze match, by the way. But Lowry has chosen Red Comet, which is a map we saw before that Google Frog does not have an easy time with. At least, not as well as Drone, but then again, Lowry and Google Frog. Interesting to see how that compares. Game is starting, though. Google Frog, northeast corner of the map. He is not starting a factor quite yet. Lowry, southwest corner. More for the battle comm. And heavy tanks coming in from Google Frog. Lowry going for light vehicles. We haven't seen a light vehicle heavy tank matchup on Red Comet this entire tournament. Kind of surprisingly. At least we haven't seen it. It may have happened elsewhere, but didn't happen in any of the games I was casting. Kodachi coming up for Google Frog. No surprise there. And darts coming in. One dart. So one dart and a scorcher. Looks like. Is Lowry going to. I think he's going to go for a bit more of a strong raid. Definitely scouting with that dart. That scorcher. We'll see what he's up to with it. If he continues with the raid, at this point, he's only signaling a scout. No, two darts. No, I think he's going for a bit of a light raid. See where he goes with this, though. He does have center control, so he's... No, never mind. That was not stopping. That's just internet. Anyway. Looks like he might be just keeping one to keep the center, or keep a tab on the center. He does have a slight disadvantage in economy, but let's see. Is he expanding as well? Doing the same thing that Drone is... Mason's being built. Welder's being built. Google Frog. Let's see if he expands in two directions. Kodachi is able to get rid of one of the darts. No surprises there. The other dart coming from the south will be up against this commander here. And actually, commander's not morphing. Google Frog not morphing his commander. That dart not able to do much. And drone's commander, Riot Cannon E Cell with a Battlecom chassis. Curious if Larry's going to go for a direct assault. He is going to expand pretty aggressively. Not building any defenses or anything, just going for metal extractors, relying entirely on riot cannon. And Flores is back. Okay. I'm Welcome here. back, Flores. I'm back again. Okay, so yeah, pointing out that you, know, you can see the state of the game. You can see what's going on. Lowry's commander actually I, taking a bit of damage, too. I see tanks and I see vehicles. Yep, and Lowry was going for a slight, slightly more aggressive scout, a couple darts, but he didn't actually go with both darts. He is, however, able to get rid of that Kodachi. Nicely done. Losing a Scorcher in process, though. But still, that's worth it for cost. On yep. the other hand, Commander. Battle Chassis moving forward aggressively. Same time, Google Frog moving forward aggressively. It looks like Google Frog is learning his lesson from Drone, in fact. Although he's using tanks, not vehicles. True, and when you're using tanks, this is what you do regardless. It's just the thing to do. Yeah, that style we were talking about doesn't work with tanks because the constructors are expensive and the units are expensive. So you don't have a cheap scout, you don't have cheap constructors. No, and the thing is, he really needs to get some laser charts on that too. Probably will pretty soon, but he doesn't have any right now. And Panther coming in for Google Frog, trying to deal with these Scorchers. We'll be able to take out one of them. But the other one gets away from the looks of it. Able to take out a metal extractor too. One free max, pretty much, for that scorcher. Two free max as well. Nice, nice. Oh man, that's. Wait, two? Can't, can't. Oh, maybe no, I just miscounted. I think it's the one. Can't because... panthers run down scorchers? Hmm. Oh, panthers. Well, it's a matter of who kites who. Like, scorchers oh, kite panthers. I thought panthers were faster than scorchers. Did they change that? Uh, you can check. Panther has a speed of 3.4. Scorchers have a speed of 3.7. No, Scorchers are faster. No, I mean, did I change the speed of the Panther? Because I used to think, I Panthers, think so. were the fastest. And I think but at this point, well, Panthers are basically meant to counter Scorchers somewhat, but only as Scorchers let them. Yeah, they come in close enough. Cool. Because, yeah, Panthers got heavily nerfed, and I don't know how much you know about the nerfs. But, yeah, they were kind of... They've been flipping around in balance a lot recently. So even saying what they yeah. do right now is a little bit hard to actually say, as it were. Yeah. That's kind mm. of a thing. But anyway, Google Frog is actually pretty open with his commander. 
It is a recon com. He's just now morphing it half across the map, and a comp snipe is in com. Oh no, Lowry is Lowry gonna go for the comp snipe? I think he yes he is. Lowry's going for the comp snipe, and there's nothing to defend against this. Google Frog jumps away. His only hope is to get out of the way by jumping. But even that, no, that's enough. That will give him a chance to get out of there. If he was <laughs> 121 health, my goodness, that is close. If it that was not a recon direction com, that, that much. <laughs> if that was not a recon com, Google Frog would have lost it. Only jump saved him. Oh yeah, but also the micro of Lori. He re changed direction so the turret. Oh got... yeah, the turret didn't quite move as quickly. That is another big thing. It just 120 HP. That's one third of a second of. I know, but that, point damage. That's all he did. <laughs> that, that's, that's the thing with micro in this game is just. Like I said before, yeah. earlier in the game, or earlier in the matches, that turrets are huge. If the turrets aren't turning properly, you lose. If they are turning properly, yeah. you win. But that's a huge thing about vehicle micro that I learned very quickly against drone is that you got to make sure your turrets are focusing the way you want them to. Otherwise, you're just not going to be able to yep. hit. You're and set target also works very well for that. It does, but I found with set target that it only really works if they're close enough that the units can actually viably shoot at them. Like if the target's out of range, then it's not going to bother aiming. This is no, that's true. That's true. Of course, that is one thing that gives levelers a bit of a disadvantage: is that levelers do not have a rotating turret. No, oh, indeed. So you can definitely be. You can get around them pretty well, assuming that you don't die to the riot cannon first. I mean, that's kind of the advantage, the disadvantage they get for having an instant hit weapon. And an air switch very early for Google Frog. Six minute mark. Air switch is coming far. in. Indeed. Neither of them have any units planned in it, though. And Reaper's coming up for Google Frog. At the same it's time. It's really consolidating it on a very... How do you call it? A uh, position... position? Yeah, it's, it's... It's not a position you want to concede to. You want to have no. those turrets more to the front. Well, I don't know. I mean, he is playing tanks, and tanks are really good at just pushing out and muscling through. Yeah, maybe. And granted, you're right. He is seeding, he is seeding a lot of map control. I mean, at this point, Lowry has the south, he has the north, he has the west. Although, Lowry is doing the same and he doesn't need to. Yeah, the thing is that Lowry, like I said, he has the south. Based on the scorch, he, he very softly has the south, but he can easily keep tabs on it. So yeah, Lowry definitely. Has and the north, he, he's trying, trying to... Uh, close up that gap with lizards. Um, Why? He doesn't need to. He can do that later. Especially three lizards in the north. I mean, that's not going to happen. Nothing's oh. going to matter with that now. And, and Leveler's coming in to fight the Panthers. And one Panther goes down. Leveler is slightly stunned, but not enough. These Levelers are not getting hit hard enough. Get back, 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 back. Or do you still want to snipe it? Okay, no. snipe it. Now go back. I don't know. No, he's... you cannot stay there. I don't know why he's going for this. He's going for it, though. And the Reaper... Okay, the Reaper's going to finish this. That's a lot. And the center of the map, Scorchers coming in are going to actually get dealt with. Going to take over Welder, though. Three Army Scorchers for one Welder. Army preservation. That's how this works. And Lowry did not preserve his army on three exactly. occasions. And is this the third occasion? These Scorchers coming into their deaths to the Lotuses. Going to not kill even one. Not even one. And at the same time, Google Frog moving south. He's going to be tearing apart everything. This is what I mean. Tanks can just push, especially with Reapers. They one shot most everything. Especially, they one-shot mexes, they two-shot laser turrets, they one-shot most of the units that are coming at him. It's just... And the Reaper do. does not die. It just doesn't die. What's Google for doing with this air? Uh, he has two bombers. Um, Lowry's going Lowry three bombers. Three. Lowry has three, yeah. Lowry's got, um, well, a bit of damage on that Reaper, but it's not dead. And if it's not dead, it's... It might as well be full health. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not just alive. If it's not dead, it's at full health. Like, that's the thing. Oh, if you haven't God killed it, it's... It is undamaged. It's dead, or it's fully alive. No in between. Because <laughs> exactly. it's going to get repaired. If, if it has 1 HP, it's still shooting. If it has 1 HP, it has 6200 HP. Sorry, 6800 HP. Because no. it's going to retreat, and it's going to repair, and it's going to come at you for no extra cost. Because everyone accesses energy all the time. <laughs> but south, we do see Scorch coming in. Nice job gets... well, sort of nice job. The Welder actually terraforms itself into a hole to avoid that. Clever little move there. Oh, I hate this. 
Oh, you hate terraforming boy. into a hole? Hey, yeah. Shadow's coming in. Calm's knife gonna happen, and Lowry doesn't care. His commander is... Okay, his ESL commander, yes, but he doesn't care. And there goes the commander, because... Well, Lowry... Actually, no, you know what? Lowry does care. That was actually a fair amount of his economy. That was, about, uh, that was a third of his energy right there. I underestimated that. Small mistake in my part. Face. Yeah, sure. But, Scorchers here, wisely used, could get rid of these re Reapers. But like I said, Reapers getting healed. What did I say? One health to 6,800. Those Reapers might as well not have been hit. Although, one of the bombers coming in trying to, well, trying to do one last hit with its own body. Not succeeding. Scorchers are doing a much better job. My goodness, these Scorchers. These Scorchers. Google Frog, Google Frog is doubling the army value, but... He's doubling the it's... army value, but the position advantage is not there. He's losing the north side completely. Uh, it's side, only those Reapers. It is, and he needs to push. I think he just needs to push forward. Just raid through, go to the south, sweep west, and then tear apart the factories. That's all he has. He has the vamps to get rid of this. Actually, he doesn't even have to sh worry about shadows. They're gone. Uh, Lori, Lauri is accessing, and he doesn't have the energy. No, That's and he's macro fight hard. fail. Micro mistake. He needs, yeah, he needs more power plants. That that commander snipe. If there was nothing else that I mean, Lowry was actually taking most of the map too, and Lowry still has a bit of a chance, but Google Frog is doing exactly what I suggested. Well, not quite going to the south as quickly, but he is going south, he is sweeping west. It's This is it. Lowry's losing most of his economy at this point. He is doing the opposite, sweeping from the north to east, getting rid of these Panthers, but losing or getting a lot of Scorchers stunned, not doing him any favors. And Google Frog, his vamps not helping out much either. Admittedly, nothing to really help out with. <laughs> oh! What the. Lotuses! Everywhere in the south. Well, Google Frog's got the <laughs> he's south now. He's making a castle. He's, what? He's making a castle. Oh, with the lotuses? Yeah, but the constructor got killed anyway. Oh, well. And the Reapers actually. One of them! Oh my! The Reapers! Kill no! him! Kill him! He's not know. going for them. He's not going for the dive because he can kill all three of those Reapers. And that's... No, he's not focusing on them enough. But he, okay, he's got one. Nope. Well, my he, keyboard is... Come on. One down. One down. Two down. He can get the second one. He's not focusing the right one. Banisher is finishing this off. He can focus down that one last Reaper. He gets the one last Reaper. Two Reapers. But that wasn't enough. He could have killed all three. Ouch. Bad focus. Bad micro there. Set target would have been his friend heavily. Yeah, really. Um, Loudy? After the game, just go into your options menu, look for set target in unit commands, and set and it to T. assign it to any button. Like, I I actually, it was kind of funny, I realized I looked at my own hotkeys for a little, like, two weeks ago, and I noticed that had T on Resurrect. But the thing is, I never morphed to level 2, so what does it matter? And even if I do, Resurrect isn't a hotkey worthy key if I don't need to. Yeah, just Maybe click on the record. <laughs> yeah, just click, or just click on the record, just click the button, you don't have to do it fast enough. So, set target on the other hand, you have to do it in an instant. So I set that to T instead of Resurrect. I think Resurrect actually is by default T, come to think of it. Set target really should be. Set target for me is V, and cancel target is uh, Shift V. Oh, yeah, Shift T, that would work cancel target. I just don't have a cancel target hockey set. I should do that. However, Reapers coming to the south. Google Frog didn't quite push this as hard as he wanted to, because he did lose a lot of his Reapers, but the Banishers making up for the Reapers. And... Uh, he's won. He's won. I agree. This is it. I, he should go for Goliath. I want to see him just push out a Goliath. Make it happen. Come on, Google Frog. Push out Goliath. One? Uh, has he enough experience yet? What? No. Does he have enough experience yet? No, he cannot morph any of his Not Reapers. Morph, no, just build. Just hard build a Goliath. For how much metal does it cost nowadays? 2200. So, at its current economy, it would take somewhere around 40 seconds ish if he pushes everything mm. into it. But hey, it'd be cool. A bit of a troll move, but still. 40 seconds and he gets a Goliath. Tears about everything. However, Scorch is coming from the north. Lowry going for one last shot. One last shot at third place. With these Scorchers. Disarmed. Nope. All disarmed. Every one of them disarmed. And Shadow's just taking them out. At the same time, Reaper's finishing out the base. A Stinger up, but not in time. Reaper's and Banishers are going to tear that up. And that will be game. Lowry's going to throw in the towel. That'll be matched. That'll be third place for Google Frog. And then we'll see Randy versus... Drone. Drone. And Lowry. GG's. 
Third place goes to Google Frog. Fourth place goes to Lowry. And Randy versus Throne is our next and final match. 2-0 for Google Frog. Nicely done. Yeah. And it was nicely played by Google Frog. He yeah, so cool and he just played it out nicely. He did indeed. Okay, so next map is going to be Wanderlust. <laughs>